unlike the first half of the competition where he failed his first attempt in the snatch, this time he gets away to a decent start. And this is absolutely critical because he's head-to-head -head with an arch-rival in the shape and form of Dmitry Lapikov of Russia. Just a kilo between him and Lapikov at the end of the first half of the competition. 416 kilos. And Dawenga marching, that is, the heavier of the two men. Lapikov still waiting in the wings. Group earlier in the day. And there is uh, Lapikov, Dmitry Lapikov for Russia. With maybe a very good chance of taking this championship. This for the lead in the clean and jerk and overall third place. His last chance. At least he's got the clean this time. No, not convinced about the right arm. And the bar's gone behind anyway and off the platform, so it doesn't count. And I'm afraid that leaves him on 395. Various infringements there. Making it easy, sadly, for the judges to give him three white lights, but, uh, three red lights, I should say, but no choice. He did have a press out, as we'll see in a moment again. I'm sure they'll show it to us. Have a look at the right arm. There, it unlocks. And then he just isn't in control. He's not motionless, and the bar goes behind. You have to put the bar down in front of you. So... <coughs> Out of the medals. And Dmitry Lapikov now 222 for his opening clean and jerk. So Martin Dewenga had a kilo advantage over this man in the first half of the competition. This would pretty well bring them back even Stephen on 416. But Lapikov the lighter. The lighter man is steady and standing tall there. A judge to have been correctly executed there. So 416 lighter body weight takes Lapikov ahead of Marcin Dewenga as it did in the Olympic Games in Beijing last season. Dewenga still two attempts left and of course this man has two attempts as well so they are literally head-to-head -head, nip and tuck change 223 kilos please another lifter so seven lifts to go one for Konstantinov I should say five lifts to go, uh, seven lifts to go. One for Konstantinov, two for Marcin Dewenga, two for Albert Kuzilov, and two for Dmitry Lapikov. So, 2.26 for Marcin uh, Dewenga, five kilo increase to go, 4.21. It's a kilo more than he did in the Olympics when he didn't get a medal. And even the bouncing couldn't help him to drive up there. Certainly a weight he's achieved. It was achieved last by him in Chiang Mai in 2007 at the World Championships when he didn't get a total. He ran into problems in the 27. Konstantinov also lurking for clean and jerk on us. But if he wants to be world champion, he needs to pick this up. He won the title with 415 kilos in Santo Domingo back in 2006. But he's against it now. Must make this. <laughs> so 
pretty hard clean. Well, strong overhead and relief because he's done all he can. 421 kilos. As I said, that's a kilo more than he did in Beijing, but will a kilo be enough to hold off the likes of Dmitry Lapikov? The odds are against rather than four because Lapikov's got two attempts. looks as if he could take his rival on this occasion but not under the bar and in trouble have a look now Konstantinov coming for 228 now this would boost him up to 408 and because of lighter body weight, would not only put him in the lead in the clean and jerk, but also would put him into bronze <laughs> overall. But he can't catch it on his shoulders, so he goes by. And there is just one man remaining, and he represents Georgia. So, some crucial failures, but there is one man who has a possibility if he can make it he's at the moment 13 kilos off the pace and the bar going to 230 so he weighed in and I'm talking about Albert Kuzilov at 104.65 that is lighter than Marcin Dorwenga who has 421 kilos dowenga has got a 13 kilo advantage. Kuzilov is about to try and close the gap by picking up nine of those kilos. If he does this, he will go one kilo ahead of Lapikov and go from overall bronze to silver. So that is why this weight has been chosen. Justin drives up. It wasn't easy. No. So he's got one more attempt. So Kuzilov, well he's done 227, he did that in the Olympic Games, but this is seven kilos more than that. This is a very big ask. The odds are really against, particularly on the evidence of the second clean. No, it's not there. Not there. He might as well have gone for the 230, to be honest, but he wanted to go for it, and it means that Martin Dewenga for the second time in his life at 